마마 마마 무 안녕하세요 마마 무입니다 Anyway Hello everyone, welcome to another video Thank you so much for clicking on it, I really appreciate it Today <sighs> Mumbiol is here um, Now I haven't really had a chance to talk about Mumbiol Mu very much on this channel um, Because I started it too late to get solo solo and yeah well yeah i just haven't had a chance to talk about them very much um but today we get to because moonbiol has dropped the performance video for absence um as part of her repackage of the um of her album i know words i'm really excited so i'm not i'm not doing the words too great today um but yeah mama Moo have really been um hitting us on all sides with all of the content. We've had uh, Wien over here just dropping every which kind of cover and like dance cover, musical cover, everything just over there. Um, which by the way, I have a reaction recorded for her most recent um, dance cover. I can't remember which song it's to now off the top of my head, but I have it recorded. Um, I just haven't gotten around to editing it yet, but if you want to see that, let me know and I will pop it up ASAP. Um, yeah, and then we've got, you know, Huasa being her badass self now on Instagram. Um, we're just waiting for her to drop something. Lord knows it'll destroy us. Oh, and she did have that um, collab with which one is it? The band. Oh no, I love the song as well, but I can't remember what it is. <laughs> but yeah, we've got Huata over there, um, killing it on Instagram. And we have Solo, who's just wrapped up the Spit It Out um, promotions. See this little, this little thing here? This absolute beast of an album that I have to leave it there because it won't stand up. Um, yeah, and now we've got Moonbiol back again. Um, as if we didn't have enough with Eclipse. God, that killed me when that came out. But now we've got her back again with Absence and I am super excited. I have seen the teasers for it. Um, I didn't react to them because I wasn't sure if that would be something you guys would be interested in, but... And also, um, I kind of wanted this to be my first official Mama Mamamoo reaction because Moonbiol is one of my alt biases. But yeah, um, I, yeah, I'm just super excited to get into it because those teasers were amazing. I'm ready to hear those vocals and just see what she's bringing to us this time. Uh, so we're gonna get into it now. Uh, I've already checked, there's no English captions yet as is typical of Mamamoo, uh, but I will go back and look at the lyrics later on and see exactly what we're dealing with. For now, we'll just enjoy the visuals, enjoy the music and yeah, let's crack on. Alrighty, Moonbiol, Absence, performance video. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> okay, first up, she looks amazing, as always. <laughs> she knows her audience as well. <laughs> Sounds so good. Right, I'm just gonna pause it there for a second. When I heard that bit in one of the teasers, like Moonbiol's very, very good at putting emotion in her voice. All of the Mama Moo girls are, but Moonbiol's very, very good at it because she has that, you know, that lower register. It just, it just hits different, you know? <laughs> okay, right, let's continue. Mm -hmm. 
possible. So I'm just gonna say the group of dancers she works with. Hold on, hold on, we gotta we're rewatching that bit, sorry. Um but yeah, this this group of dancers that she works with, I'm assuming it's the same, if not at least very similar to the group of dancers she worked with for Eclipse. They're so good. They're so good and they make her look so good. I mean, she makes her look so good, let's be honest, but they also help to make her look so good. And yeah, okay, right, let's. <laughs> that lower vocal effect during the harmony there was... Oh, I like that outfit. Is she wearing like a double shirt? <laughs> yeah. Love it. What a look. I love when artists do that in songs. Oh my god. <laughs> I love this woman so much. Um, Mamamoo, after Blackpink, Mamamoo were the second group that I got into um, K-pop wise. I love them to death, I think they're so talented and Moonbyul, you know, it is, I think out of all of the groups I know, Mamamoo I think is perhaps the hardest group to have a bias in. Um, but there is always something about Moonbyul that stood out to me and I think it's because you kind of have like two different kinds of biases. At least I do. I have two different kinds of biases. I have the the, the biases that I... This is going to sound really wrong, but I don't mean it necessarily how it sounds. But like biases that you're like attracted to. And I don't mean that necessarily in like a physical sense, but you're like you're attracted to their talent. I, I know there's a better way to word it, but I don't... Yeah. Um, or there's the biases that you relate to. And I'd say... A good 95% of the biases I have are in the former category where it's just like it's it's their talent it's their personalities it's like something about them that just draws me to them that's the word that's the wording I was looking for I'm drawn into them um whereas with Moonbyul like obviously she's super talented obviously you know her personality is hilarious um but the thing that really grabbed me about her was the fact that I related to her and I could see a part of myself in her with you know the fact that we both present very androgynously and I, I seeing that in k-pop even at the time when I knew very little about it I could still see that there was this you know a big pressure on female idols to present a certain way seeing Moonbyul was like this just breath of fresh air and especially in the last yeah I, th I think yeah over the last couple of years seeing her more and more like come into herself at least that's what it appears to be like you know dressing the way that she feels the most comfortable and the way she feels the most powerful um and being allowed to do that I just yeah I just I love her so much and I think she is such a powerful idol and such a powerful image in the industry um and this song like we want to talk about all-rounder idols 
I don't think there's another idol that I can think of that is more well-rounded than Moonbiol is. At least from what I've seen so far. Um, and you know, I have sp spent a decent amount of time looking into a lot of different groups, both before and since starting doing these videos. Um, yeah, I have so much respect for her. I think she's an incredible person, um, at least from what we see. Uh, obviously, you know, we only see so much, but yeah. Um, I just want to very quickly, this beginning, um, where she's doing the arm movements and the subtleties with the way that she hits the like the just the tiniest little beats that are in the music at the beginning like it's something that Mumbu is really good with with her dancing like she's not she's not Cheyenne she's not Momo she's not um Chunga but there's something about the way Mumbu dances that is so detail oriented and she's really good with those like isolated movements and very subtly hitting a beat like it's not i mean she can be super powerful but in this like for example it's not super powerful it's more gentle but still hitting um but yeah i just want to re-watch that bit also the hands thing like she knows her freaking audience <laughs> Yeah, okay, so there where she went like that. No, she went like that. <laughs> um, so it's just this very subtle. And you can just hear in the music, there's this little. And there where she brings her head down. And even there, her hand falls on the beat. It's so detail oriented, it's amazing. She knows how to use her body with the music so well, like it's so detail oriented. Um, and I'm not saying that she's the best at it in the industry, I'm not saying anything like that, I'm just saying that in this video she is showing such a wide range of her abilities, it's insane. Like you're seeing her ability with dance, you're seeing her like very impressive vocal ability and you're seeing her rap ability as well not that she needs to show that any more than she has done because lord knows she is one of the best rappers in the game right now in the k-pop game right now um but yeah Right, I think I've talked long enough. That's gonna be enough for my rant on Moonbeal. Um, As I said in the beginning, if you wanna see my reaction to that um, We In Dance cover, let me know and I will do so. Um, otherwise, uh, I have pretty much seen everything there is to see in Mamamoo related, um, but I will be, as and when they drop new content, I will react to it and you will see it on this channel. So um, yeah, <sighs> go and support this song, man. This is an amazing song. An amazing, an amazing song and a beautiful video. I don't know, are we getting a full music video? I have no idea. If you know, let me know, because I actually have no idea. Um, but yeah, go and support it, give it a like, share it, do all of the, the stuffs and the things. And um, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.